All right, so here's a quick video on the DJI FV system and quads that have GPS. So there's been some debate and I got some information out there that says that the latitude and longitude information in the DJI FV goggles is not useful at all. And so you shouldn't put it on your OSD if you're using the custom OSD feature. Um, I tend to disagree with that because it is still useful if you crash. Um, now people say that when you crash, if you lose power, you, you, the screen goes blank, of course, uh, but the OSD information freezes and whatever the last coordinates were recorded at the time of the video freeze will stay on the screen. And at the same time, even after about 30 seconds, it'll go completely blank and the OSD information will disappear. You hit any of the buttons here on the goggles and that same information will reappear. So let me quickly demonstrate how that works. I'm using the Explorer LR here with the GPS. I'm not going to wait for a GPS lock. I'm just going to show you the GPS elements on the screen and I'll power off the quad and show you that the information still stays on the goggles. So at the very least, you know, even though you have no signal from the quad, you can take a photo of the uh, goggle screen and at least know what your GPS coordinates are of the last uh, place where the uh, last recording was for your quad in case it crashed, something like that. Okay, so you can see the GPS coordinates there. They're not, they're all zeros right now. I'll go ahead and disconnect the quad. So you can see there that the GPS coordinates are still on the screen along with all the rest of the image or the OSD elements. And you can see that uh, you have the DJI logo here. It's basically your uh, frozen screen or black screen. And this will stay on for about 30 seconds. And then once it disappears after about 30 seconds, I will just press a button here. There you go. So it disappeared. I'll press the button again. There's the uh, finder alarm going off and you can see the elements are back on the screen. So uh, at least you can take a photo or a video of the screen and get your GPS coordinates and find out where you last crashed. Anyway, I just wanted to share that information with you guys. I was being told by some people that um, it was you know, not very useful to have the latitude and longitude information on the screen because it isn't recorded in the uh, OSD stream um, in the SRT file but you can see that it's still on the goggle screen and you can basically leave it on there indefinitely as long as you have power and bring up that screen again and whatever was last frozen on there if you just hit a button on the, or any of the controls on the goggle itself. And at least you can take a photo of the GPS coordinates and know where you last crashed. Okay, anyway, that's gonna do it for this video. Hopefully you found it helpful and I'll talk to you guys in the next one.